And it was a close vote, but the United Methodist Church ultimately decided not to change their stance on same-sex marriage and gay and lesbian ministers, which means the church will continue to ban gay weddings and gay church leaders. More than 800 leaders voted on the decision this week at a conference. The decision passed in a 53% to 47% vote. And we talked to a Topeka LGBT activist about this. He says despite the decision, he still believes local Methodist churches will be accepting of LGBT members. Their mission is a good one, and uh, I just wish they could have love for one another, not just uh, declare, hey, this is a sin, uh, because the Bible, the translated Bible says so. Now, Todd Seifert with Great Plains Con Conference of United Methodists in Topeka said in a statement regarding the decision, quote, it's important to note that the, the, the decisions made in St. Louis by 864 clergy and lay delegates from around the world, our church's legislative branch, sets the policy of the church and determines church law. It's also important to note that not everyone agrees with those decisions, just as we as Americans disagree at times with Congress.